Welcome to the social lens and thank you for watching. In a case that has captivated public attention and underscored the need for vigilant financial oversight, we delve into the shocking tale of Mrs. Tian Kamp, a former bookkeeper at Medtronic. Today, we unravel one of the most audacious white-collar crimes in South African history. Stian Kamp, once a trusted employee, embarked on a staggering 13-year-long embezzlement spree that shook the foundation of Medtronic, a renowned medical device company. At the heart of our audacious scheme was her position as a bookkeeper, a role she cunningly exploited. Her elaborate web of deception involved concealing fraudulent transactions and manipulating financial records. Her meticulous manipulation of the company's financial structure allowed her to siphon funds undetected, ultimately amassing a jaw-dropping 500 million rand. The veil of deception began to lift during a routine financial audit at Medtronic. External auditors stumbled upon fabricated transactions and puzzling inconsistencies that eventually led to the revelation of the embezzled funds. The scale of the fraud, exceeding half a billion rand, sent shockwaves through Medtronic's management and the business community at large. The realization that a trusted employee had betrayed their confidence for over a decade left the company in disbelief. Stiernkamp faced a staggering 336 charges related to fraud and theft, a testament to the complexity and audacity of her criminal activities. However, a surprising twist awaited as she entered the courtroom. In a move that stunned both the prosecution and the public, she pled guilty to all charges. Her admission of guilt spared the court from a prolonged trial, a trial that would have further exposed the extent of her financial misconduct. The question that looms large is, what drove Stian Kamp to orchestrate such a colossal theft? Speculation swirl, with some attributing her motives to personal financial struggles or extravagant aspirations. Creating fictitious vendors, inflating invoices, and skillfully rerouting funds to her personal accounts, Stian Kamp navigated the company's accounting system like a virtuoso. Her ability to remain undetected for years solidified her reputation as a master of financial manipulation. Today, the courtroom stands as the theater of justice. Stian Kamp's sentencing hearing has drawn the eyes of the media, legal experts, and the public alike. What balance will the legal system strike between retribution and rehabilitation? What lessons can businesses and individuals glean from this staggering case of financial misconduct? As we witness justice in action, South Africa watches with anticipation, awaiting answers that go beyond mere verdicts. If you found this video informative, please click the like button and consider subscribing to the channel. Until next time.